There is no place more beautiful than Vancouver Island, and it's a birder's paradise. From songbirds all the way up to raptors. We're so blessed to have an abundance of, of raptors that call Vancouver Island home. We're in Arrington, which is the home of the North Island Wildlife Recovery Centre. Our mission is to partner with the public and the community on Vancouver Island to help wildlife. At the centre, we rehabilitate almost all native animals. We also work uh, extensively with raptors. On Vancouver Island this summer, we had an exceptional heat wave, and that heat wave was very dramatic for our eagles, both young and old. The young eagles were leaving the nest early because it was just exceptionally hot. They were hitting the ground, and the parents were Unfortunately, in a position where they were struggling themselves and the young um, basically got abandoned. And so that is the particular case with this eagle. So we got her back to the center. We were able to build her back up and build her back up. And she was a really great patient. She was uh, very feisty, which is a good thing to see from eagles. And she progressed beautifully. Okay, you've got a good grip. Awesome. So what we're going to do first and foremost is we're going to check her body condition, uh, her overall body condition. And there's an eagle down here somewhere. Mm -hmm. And there it is. So she's, yeah, she's in, in very, very good condition. Well-defined pectoral muscles and a, a nice, nice layer of, of subcutaneous fat there. Nice. Muscle definition in the legs, good mobility. This eagle is in great shape and uh, ready for her final stage of rehabilitation, and that's into the, the flight enclosure with the others. We were so blessed on Vancouver Island to have so much amazing wildlife. For us at North Island Wildlife Recovery Centre and, and me on a personal level, to be able to give back anything that I can is amazing because the, the nature and the natural beauty that Vancouver Island has given me is immense. There, there's, no, there's no way to quantify it. So as, as much help that I can give to wildlife, big or small, it, it's all a really magical, a magical thing that I don't take lightly and I am very cognizant of how lucky I am and how thankful I am to be able to do what I am doing.